It's Friday night. I just got home. It's after midnight. It's been a very exciting and eventful evening for sure. I didn't start the vlog soon enough though, so let's rewind a little. So we have traveled back in time to earlier on Friday evening and we're at Georgetta's place for my engagement party. Georgetta and Annie threw Grant and I an engagement party and sadly Grant couldn't make it in, but it was so much fun. I honestly wasn't even expecting to get to have an engagement party and this was just totally perfect. I mean, these cakes, these napkins, are you seeing the napkins? I love these napkins. <laughs> So it was definitely a very exciting night and it just got a little bit more exciting. I have a special guest. Surprise! Oh, hello. A surprise visitor. A surprise visitor <laughs> has appeared. Do you want some cake? Yeah. Do you want some pizza? Yeah. I have leftovers. <laughs> How are you, little boo? Yeah, if there is cake in this house, it is going to be had for breakfast. That's the way I live. Can you deal with that? Oh, I can deal with that. The naked cake. It's nude. It's a nude cake. Is that a oh, okay. All right, that's a breakfast portion. <laughs> All right. Good morning. It is last day. I have a lovely assistant, a reluctant assistant. This is helpful. This is good stuff that you're getting. I'm getting a little. Wait, why are you getting full body though? Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm because I'm here. I'm here for. I'm here for three hours. I'm getting some. <laughs> yeah. I'm you're getting shot. Here for three hours. I'm getting some B-roll. So wait, you you're all about Disney World or Disneyland? Both. Both. So you just switch off. Yeah. Oh yeah. my gosh, I've been begging Grant to go to Disney World since like the day we met. Did you miss Houston? Now that you've been in California for a few yeah, weeks? Yeah, all that nice weather gets so monotonous. <laughs> He's over it. <laughs> yeah, it has to be like the worst weather today. Like all of a sudden, extreme storm. Actually, it's it's already a little bit better than it was, but it was kind oh, of extreme. Hence the rain jacket. It's not exactly a rain jacket, but this is my version of a rain jacket. And I had to like leave my eyes naked because with lash lift, you can't wear mascara the first day. So I'm like, newborn baby style. Not quite, but you know. Five guys. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You can't make me eat that hot dog. this big box and I'm gonna show you what I got I got a real random assortment of things um, meanwhile we have to decide if we're gonna go to the movies you don't think so it's raining so hard and it's like getting worse again so number one I got what I thought was a pet bed for Luna she destroyed her last one I think I showed that in the last vlog, I think. She's just, she's just, she's just bad. And then this one is like, 
kind of too small for her. I don't know, she sat on it for a second. I think she might like it and it's kind of obnoxious looking. And if she destroys it, it won't be a big deal. I also got some new pillows and these are the Beckham Hotel Collection Super Plush Gel Fiber Filled Pillows. Look, they're so flat. I have to get some seals. Where's your scissors? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, we work on these pillows. I also got some Myers Clean Day. Ew, ew. Is significantly leaking. Yeah. Not, not the best. Ooh, it's growing. Ooh. Yeah, I, I wish it was a little firmer. So I also got a three pack of the dish soap because I was like completely out. The scent I really like is the lemon verbena. You can get this at Target too. Or that's where I found it and then I just started ordering on Amazon because I never shop outside of my home. <laughs> that's not true, but kind of true also. I also got a three pack of the Optic White Colgate toothpaste. I'm like completely out of toothpaste and I've been using like the mini baby size that I have in my little travel toiletries thing. It's a bleak situation over here. I also got, this is kind of random, I got two little, are these lacrosse balls? Grant introduced me to these. You can use them kind of like you use a foam roller and you can like work out knots and tightness and stuff. And I used to use Grant's, but since he moved so far away, I decided to get my own. I also got a new spatula. I was kind of planning on doing a little cooking this weekend. This is like a big one. I thought this would be helpful. It almost looks like comically large. All right, and the last thing I got is a book. It's called The Hard Questions. I'm sure Grant was very excited that this arrived while he was visiting. Um, it's the 100 essential questions to ask before you say, I do. Um, I can't remember what I was looking up. I think Amazon was just like stalking my life and they knew that this would totally work for me. But I found this book and it was definitely like an impulse buy. No one told me that they liked it or anything and I even saw like a negative review about it. But it basically just has a hundred different kind of like general life questions that are like things that you need to discuss and like be on the same page about before you get married. Which like maybe you're supposed to do this before you get engaged but like oh well. It goes over all like a whole bunch of different subjects and then there's like sets of questions within each. So here's a sample. Oh! What if one of us is attracted to someone else superficially or deeply? That's a serious question. I thought these were supposed to be just like, okay, like, are we gonna have date nights? <laughs> what do you like about my family of origin? What do you dislike? These questions are not playing around. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. It says it focuses on key areas of married life, such as home, money, work, sex, community, friends, family, and spirituality. It probably will, would take like a really long time to get through all these questions though. I'm gonna go ask her 100 questions. I'll let you know how it goes. Actually, we should just film the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. Share it with the world, why not? So another thing, I didn't like properly start the vlog before the engagement party last night. Grant was not there. He arrived later. He arrived like much, much later. He, it was actually kind of a surprise that he was coming. He decided he was coming like midweek this week-ish and this party was already planned and everything. I wish he could have been there, but it was not meant to be. I still had an amazing time. I ate a lot of pizza and the Snapchat filter was so cute. I, it was just perfect and I have a lot of cake left over. I can't believe you're visiting already after just two weeks. It makes me happy though. Mm, makes me happy. I just revealed that I'm gonna get my wisdom teeth out next week to Grant. He's really sad that he can't be here to make fun of me and my puffy cheeks. <laughs> 
so Grant came all the way from California and we are at Lowe's. He decided to help me with some home things that I needed help with. So sweet. I feel bad, but at the same time, like, so sweet. We're trying to get a drill. We got some air filters. It's a big day. <laughs> just trying to fix my doorbell. It's just hanging on by a thread. See if I can do this one try. No hands. One try, handless, parallel parking. No backup camera. I have a tough life, no backup camera. <laughs> I feel like they would just distract me, actually. Actually, all cars now, as a this model, you're required to have one. Required? Uh, is it weird that I feel like that's a little sad? I mean, it's a nice luxury, but. Yeah. It's Sunday night. We were getting. I gotta do this. What a nice vlog thing. We had a fabulous weekend together. Uh, even though I didn't get to make it to the engagement party on Friday. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you know what Georgetta said? She should have gotten like a cardboard cutout of you. It would have I been definitely need one of those. You do need one of those, lurking in your home. Lurking, moving, mysterious. Always watching. <laughs> it was only two weeks since we've seen each other, but it felt like a lot longer. It felt like forever. We have never spent that much time apart. No, no. So now we're on the way to the airport. It's 8.22, Sunday night. And this time it'll probably be like four to six weeks before we get to see each other again, unfortunately. But we're gonna talk every day on the phone or on Skype. And you're gonna be busy. You have a surgery, a minor surgical procedure next week <laughs> yeah. that you're gonna bounce right back from even though I think I think it's gonna be a bigger deal than you realize. <laughs> you're going to New York in a couple weeks. Yeah. So it's not like you're gonna be moping around the house. I'm gonna be moping. Yeah. Ch Chipmunk cheeks. Distressed maiden. <laughs> it's a beautiful night. Look at it. You're a professional vlogger. I like to vlog it, vlog it. 